Hello, this is Andrew Dugill with Hoffman Realty Tampa Property Management and this is another in our helpful blog series for Tampa landlords and this one is called How to Raise Rent. And there are two scenarios. The, the first one is between tenants and the second one is with an existing tenant. But first, you know, why raise rent? Well, being a landlord is a for-profit business and there are many factors that affect the profitability, but one of them is the amount of rent that you charge. There's usually an optimum rent for every situation, but if you can increase it, usually it will help maximize your profit. So the first scenario is between tenancies. So your tenant has just notified you that they're going to be vacating at the end of their lease. Now is the time to do a market analysis. And what you want to do is look at the price that properties similar to yours have recently rented for. There is definitely the law of supply and demand applies here. I've yet to meet a potential tenant that doesn't know the market rent. So the optimum rental amount is usually no higher than the amount that similar properties to yours have recently rented for. There's a definite danger in overpricing. If you overprice your property, it will stay on the market longer. Every five weeks a property is vacant is worth a 10% reduction in the annual rent. So don't overprice it and maximize your profit. The second scenario is renewing an existing tenant. So your existing tenant's lease is coming up for renewal and they've been a great tenant and you're really hoping that they will renew. You're justifiably nervous because you don't want a rent increase to cause your tenant to leave, but also you don't want to leave money on the table. Just like between tenancies, you'll want to do a fair, a comparable market analysis and determine the fair market rent. Generally, we have found that if you present an existing tenant with a fair market rent increase and they like the property and they like the way they have been treated, but they don't like the, the rent increase, they will usually come back to you and negotiate and this gives you a second opportunity to evaluate the rent increase. They typically don't automatically leave because the rent has increased and they don't like it. Most of the time, if you explain that this is a fair market rent and you're increasing it because your costs have increased, I mean, your taxes have gone up, your insurance has gone up, your repair costs, most of the time, a tenant will understand that. So this is our advice on how to raise rent. If you have questions about the blog today, we'd be happy to hear from you.